Hello everyone and welcome back to 13 Nights of Halloween. I'm once again here with Spoo. What's up? And we're back in spooky Japantown as we are going to continue playing this. Halloween you uh time. Yeah, we're we're working up so far. We've got two really solid jump scares. Yeah. And we're currently in Garden East. We're trying to find, I think, oh, dead body. That's absolutely a demon that's going to like come back to life when you get past it. You think so? Absolutely. It's the same model as every other demon. You got a point there. <laughs> Hello, sir. It appears that sir, do you have any things? There's one of those demons. Sir. Sir, this is a Wendy's? Sir, please. For the last time. You're going You're to not have supposed to be close. <laughs> Go God fucking damn it. The stupid fucking I ghost. bet it woke the demon up. Maybe. What, I, mm, I feel like they said that wouldn't happen if I was being cool and collected, and I was. Alright, fire. 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 No, oh, god damn it. Alright, you don't deserve the fire. This is this ending part is for me. Give him the shank. You take the shank. Alright, so. I cut you. I cut you so bad. Oh, shit. <laughs> Whoa. Oh, yo, you can finish him off? Oh, apparently so. We need to go Coup d'etat. That's cool. Or, excuse I mean, me, coup de grace. Not coup d'etat. Coup de gras, not coup d'etat. That's pretty cool. Again, I Yeah, that's, that's definitely interesting. I, I'm, I'm actually kind of getting sadder here because I was fully expecting this game to be a bad from software game. But this is actually one of their fucking bangers <laughs> games so far. So far, it's pretty, yeah, I... It's got like a lot of interesting, it's got a good mood and atmosphere. It's like, I'm equipped with stuff, but it seems like it's still scary because at the same time, like I don't know if I'm actually gonna be able to use any of the things I have correctly. Like, surprised at how well made this is for the They've era. They've always again. put together pretty good games. Like yeah. Armored Core games go back to PS1 and they were considered pretty well put together at the time. Yeah, for sure. I just mean, like, they were definitely a studio who sometimes, like, their ideas weren't fully realized at times. So oh, yeah, absolutely. A fantastic idea, but then the execution of it would be off a little bit, and that's kind of what I was thinking this would be. But I'm kind of happy to say that it's not like that. Note left by Kura, dated two weeks ago. I'll be away for some time. If something strange happens, proceed to the manor. I'll prepare many victims for you to mur- Oh, that's not good. Oh no, it's human centipede time. Oh, fuck. I just don't ever want to be the butt. Never be the butt. I also, depending on the- I thought I heard something. Depending on the centipede type, because there are three human centipedes. I dislike the idea that we even thought it was good to come up with the first one. Uh, the second movie- they get progressively worse. I mean, if they started bad, I can only assume it gets significantly worse. There is a scene, and I'm gonna. This is a scene intense enough for me to say, "Hey, maybe skip a minute," because we're maybe gonna talk about this for a while. In Human Centipede Two, where a woman who is pregnant, who is going to be in the Human Centipede, uh, gives birth, and then has to crush her baby with the car that she is escaping from, because she gave birth at literally the worst possible time. They are. Oh man. The it is possible that the human centipede hates humanity as it stands. It is not Could you imagine possible. being in a survival horror game and not just being able to be like, I'm pushing this box away and there's nothing you can do to stop me? Yeah, it, that's how I'd know I'd be screwed. If I could not actually push a box, it seems... Yeah, in real life, I'm like, oh man, I'm just going to move this box. It's like, you can't move this box. I'm like, oh no. There's also not a lot of music with this game. Yeah, it seems like it's it's a very a very uh, atmospheric game, which is impressive. Yeah, yeah, I think Silent Hill is kind of similar to that, except for there. Silent are, Hill there. Uh, also had a pretty solid. Uh, if you're attacked, struggle, struggle with all your might. Oh, I, I guess like when you get grappled, mash buttons. Yeah, maybe, but not. I'm not to say that there isn't like really good music with Silent Hill because it's. Well oh, Akira Yamaoka is like one of my favorite game producers or music producers like that dude's sick yeah he's pretty sick with it i'm just that that door was knocking right yeah so uh wokey i don't know what we're gonna 
do here? Uh, you open the door. Stuff. You don't. It's rude. You don't just let them knock on the door and not say who is it. Do I really have to go through the door? Yeah. Oh man. At least check the. Isn't there like a window thing beside the door? Oh, there is. Okay. Let me... I don't know what that is. Check it. There's some sort of device. In there. Yes. What? Seer symbol. In order to open the door, all three discs must be positioned correctly to left or right. Move the center disc first, press left or right on X to confirm. If you make a mistake, press O to undo. Where is the right direction is my question. Uh, you know what? That's a really good question because I don't have an answer for you, but maybe you have to match the symbol up? Somehow? This is the part where... Can you rotate the other discs? I can, but I think I need to... Oh, yeah, I don't... Oh, okay, so I don't know. Let's see. You have to make them look nice somehow. Oh, you know what? What are the two symbols up top here? Like a little squiggly man? So let's find a little squiggly man. This is also how I play Dokkan, by the way. I just look for some specific clue tiles. This looks like a squiggly man, but it's not the right squiggly mm, man. No, I'm not finding it. It looks like a seven. An upside down seven with a scratch through it. And I'm not seeing it on the disc. Yeah, this is uh, tough for someone unfamiliar with Japanese. Well, animation. I mean, I'm sure there's something that'll just give us the answer, but I don't know what it is. Yeah, I don't know what it is either. All right, keep moving. Go knock on that door. I think the only way to open the door is to solve the puzzle, though. Oh, you might be true. I don't know. See if, see if, like, just tell them hi. Oh. Something is hidden inside. So I obviously have to open this device if I want to. So check your inventory. Check my inventory. Yeah, see if, like, you picked up a dog statue. Like, see what the dog statue looks like. All right, let's quickly check, uh, take a look at my stuff. No, uh, nothing there. Items. Sacred cloth earth. This is the thing I lost. Go down, I guess. Manor map. Man so there you go, dog. Done. Maybe that goes to something. Mm, maybe but not this thing right now. Let me see. Oh, I'm red. It's summoned by the Lord who presides this manor. He is convinced that this manor is cursed. I believe he has an overly vivid imagination. Most likely, he saw a rat and mistook it for a creature of the other world. At least that is what I think. I shouldn't be away for very long, but take care of the shrine in my absence. You must not forget to take care of the silkworms. Also, I am worried about Kura's health. Please watch over her. That's the one woman we came here with, so we know that. And she seems ghosty, so... It does seem kind of ghosty. Alright. Uh, Let me see if I, I look at this device long enough. Something will come to me. Okay, so... This has to be... Well, I can up here. Maybe... Something like that. But then if moving this requires this to move, so it needs to be with something... There needs to be a... The first disc has to be pointed a very particular way. Yeah, and it has to be with something here. I ain't got an answer for you, bucko. This looks right to me. Oh god. You know what we should do? We should pause and look up the answer. <laughs> or All right, So like go down to the base level. This one? Yeah, and I'll move it and go to the next one. So like move it once and then swap to the next one. No no, like move it once and then the next uh circle. Oh. Alright, so it made so go back. And move it to the next one, then do it again. Nope. No, no, keep going. Right down. Yeah, keep to hear him, right? Yep. Oh shit! There you go. All right, same thing for the next one. Rotate it, hit it. Nope. 
Nope. Okay. Rotate it. And then we just have to find the right one. than I would have thought. You ready for a fist fight? Uh, do you know what's behind this? I have no idea. I'm just as excited as you are. I'm going to get my dog. <laughs> or just in case. Get my dog! Let me get my dog real quick. Now I ain't about to fight whatever's behind this without no dog. Oh shit. <laughs> Anytime you wish to dismiss them, press R2 and triangle or R2 and square. Okay, got you. Go! Help me! Go! The disordered state of confusion and movement when one encounters a tempest while running always weak. While experienced vertical cards are kind of unusable, that's not great. I need to. Ew! God, help me, dog. Right, he's gone. Get him. Get him, dog. No! Bastard. I'm oh. not wolf dog. Because oh, I need to. I'm not about to let this man live for what he did. For killing our dog. Nope. Come back, I need to stab. Come on. Damn it, it's not letting me do the, the deep stab, so it must mean he's super dead. Fires. Oh, see, I did need this. Okay, I got that guy. Somehow, <laughs> I got that guy. But this guy there, like, now he's dead. Like, nah. It must be because I killed him with, um, a fire, as opposed to my knife. Something's lying on the ground. Suit at home, more spider. I can summon more spiders, which is nice. This is the only time I'm ever gonna say summoning more spiders sounds nice. So now we need those pliers to remove stuff. But we need to find where that removing thing is. Alright, let's move on. Yeah, we haven't gone this way, right? Or have we gone this way? Spoot? Sorry, uh, something came up on my video. What's up? Okay, no. No, you... I was, like, afraid I had lost internet. Huh? Oh, no, you're you're perfectly fine, my dude. You're murdering the shit out of him. I'm proud of you. Yeah. Thank you. I'm doing my best being a... You, you, you murdered the shit out of that one guy. You were like, oh, you're laying there pretending to be dead. <laughs> exactly. This is what he's going to get. A cutscene? No, I'm in Manor West now. Oh, shit. Did I go back to Manor? <laughs> my bad. I need to go, go back this way. It's really weird that it's a full-on cutscene change for just going up here slightly. Is that a dude? Well, that's uncomfortable. Where are you go? I. Where are you going? Why are you running? <laughs> Why are you running? Come back. Why are you running? Letter from Lady Fujimara to her daughter. Dear, I am going to the store for eggs. <laughs> and I'm coming back someday. I'm going I'm to the going to because... the milk store. The manor is in danger. Yeah, the milk store. Milks are us. If it's Going safe to... there, I will come to get you. Until I signal you by ringing the bell, do not open the door. If you haven't returned in ten days, gather up the wooden disc and spikes and proceed to the temple. So I feel like the game wants me to just get those spikes and the game is over. There's a child doll here. Okay. Spell card, Hibari. Okay, cool. We got more burning arrows! Exactly, gonna burn these fools. I'm gonna try to talk to her. 
How can it be opened? I gotta ring the bell. Yeah. Hmm, you think so? We just ring the bell? Yeah, that ring a bell, one. dude. I don't know. Yeah, why? I mean, obviously. God fucking damn it. Stop doing that, stupid fucking ghosts. <laughs> I am mentally okay. <laughs> I am a strong, strong, tiny baby. piss baby. Uh, oh. Okay, didn't get me that time. Nice try, game. I was gonna say she's like having a heart attack. Okay, yeah, I can see how that's a little uncomfortable. Thank you. Get him. I think those are the ghosts they told me don't run, because if you do run, you're gonna be in big trouble. Why am I going toward God God, I hate this. Why do I How else do you solve a murder? Call the Japanese police. That's a peephole, you gotta see who he was spying on. Here for the small hole in the wall? That can only lead to good what? Just look around. Oh, yeah. This is Oh, crazy. yeah. Look at the way. They so I guess check oh. the room? Oh, dude. Oh, no. You need to get out of there. I don't want more than her. She's about to be fucking got. Oh, oh she knows. Mm. We gotta go, bud. You gotta save her. Ring the bell. The bell. I was about to say, save her. I don't care what she does. She ran from me. A partition is blocking this path. Kick it! No, I can't. I can summon fire arrows, but I can't kick a door. Right. It would be uncouth of me as a woman. Oh, no. Seal Venus. Hmm. I wonder if there's going to be... Oh, uh, there's here. writing on that wall. Seal Earth. Seal must... The seal must not be removed. The creature in there is not a gaki... Okay. Uh, what does that mean? That must mean it's one of those dudes that will just eat you, is my guess. Ew. Spooky bit. Of course, it's the servants, I was like. Servants from Men Memorandor? Me memorandum? Memorandum. Memorandum, right. I don't know why. I'd never seen the word memorandum. Terrified of the demons that come out at night, Ayaka sobs. Shut up in her room, she sleeps silently while her guitar goes on in the background. She believes the demons won't notice her if she hides in her room and doesn't make a sound. Miss Ayaka will open the door only when Lady Fujimaro rings the bell, brought from the North Pavilion. Ayaka is as beautiful as an angel. We servants have vowed to protect her no matter the cost. Sounds like a total sick man. There's something at the door. Uh, tell him to fuck off. We don't need any, like, Jehovah's Witnesses up in here. I don't know. Tell him to fuck off. I need some energy out of you, Wokey. <laughs> okay, here's my idea. Just tell him to fuck off. Spiders. Spiders! That's the energy I was looking for. Spiders. Something is pounding on the other side of the door. That much is clear. Is there, like, nowhere to hide? Just to be sure. Spider. What's up? <laughs> What's up? What's up, Strudel? How you doing? Amy? Ah, I'm gone. No, no. Can you, like, hide? Maybe? I don't know. Uh, this is another good question. It feels like it, it feels like it wants me to just stand perfectly still. But... Open the door. I'm trying to see Open if I can go that door. It's not through lack of trying. I am trying. Oh, never mind. Apparently, I could open the door. Oh god! Spider! Spider, please! Spider-Man, help me! Stab him! Oh man, spiders die real fast. No, oh, I mean that—that that was the in their car. They actually—they knew what they were getting into. Go! Shoot hot fire! Shoot! Oh, I it. spit hot fire! Damn it! Did I die? No, I have vertigo. That's worse. You're getting close. I am getting really close. Dust. Get him. Spider. 
Run. Spider, did you get him? Spider did not get him. I... Make sure you stab him to death. I am trying, but I'm also extremely drunk at the moment. Got him. I'm so high right now. So high, I think that there's a little goblin man down below. High as giraffe balls. Is that herbal dust? No. Cleanse oneself makes me feel like I could maybe use that. Get rid of Virgo, maybe? I could use during cleansing ritual. Okay. Yeah. Cleanse yourself in the waters of the Lake Minnetonka. Hmm. I will use an elixir. Just to fully heal myself. Alright. So now we know that Spider is, uh... Very fragile. They're good for a distraction, but they don't last long. No, not like Wolf. Wolf Buddy is definitely top of the list. The door won't open. Well, the bar's right there. You just... Nope, door won't open. Door, door won't open. open. God, God fucking damn. All he did was move. Oh, God. Wait. Later. Oh, he wants that ass. He's not going for it. Alright, we're safe now, I think. No, this is, yeah, this is where... Did we just go around in a circle? Yeah, we gotta figure out where the northern pavilion is. Yeah, you gotta point there. That's now where the I bell need, is. I need to go back there, though, but now I don't want to go back there because there's a giant fucking ghost on the other side of that door. So I'm just gonna go Get him. down and assume that the ghost will not be at the door. Get him. But at the same time, there's just as likely for a ghost to show up here. You never saw the uh, the opening for Ghostbusters when they're in the library? I have seen the opening to Ghostbusters. Yeah, they're sitting there and they're like, All right, what do we do? And he goes, all right, on the count of three. One, two, three. Get him! And then they get got by the library. <laughs> and then they get got and he goes, get him, Ray. <laughs> get him. That's what you got? That was it? <laughs> Hey, tell me when we get to the 42nd or the 47th floor. Why? Because I'm going to throw up. Man, Ghostbusters is, is an extremely good movie. Ah, it's, uh, it's, it's easily in my top 10. It is. Tell them about the Twinkie. The best part of the um, ladies' Ghostbusters is the part where there's a giant poster that says, Tell them about the Twinkie. And that's yeah. maybe maybe shows why that movie was a little bit misguided in a lot of places is that that was the best part pretty much was... everything with chris hemsworth in that movie was pretty funny yeah again i'm not one of those people who are like oh, I've ruined my life it's more like yeah i don't i don't have it. like listen if something's not funny i'm just gonna tell you it's not funny like yeah. i don't you like just make it better like i don't give a shit that it's all women ghostbusters yeah but funny enough, just, the, part, the, the parts where they have, like, the ghost weapon, like, when fucking they bring out the, the ghost fists, I thought that was yeah. awesome. It was They're pretty high. fucking punching ghosts left and right. I'm like, there you go. That's how you differentiate. What's the difference between Ray and this woman is that Ray wouldn't fucking throw hands with a ghost. I mean, Winston probably would. Yeah. No, Ray has a different way of handling ghosts. Winston's from the streets. Yeah, Ray waits around to see if there's a ghost blowjob in the in the order. Yeah, and he puts on his Napoleon outfit. God, I can't. I can't. Have you have you ever like read about the making of Ghostbusters, like all oh, the behind yeah. the scenes stuff? The, the, the fucking the Ghostbusters from hell, and it was supposed to be like a full on team of Ghostbusters, and it's yeah, insane. like the idea that they they made the first one is almost entirely accidental. Yeah, I love it because every time it goes to Dan Aykroyd, I think the most accurate assertion is that it feels like Dan Aykroyd is like this. Is Yo, are they eating books? Apparently, they are eating books. I saw Mia Yoshi break a seal when he was sick. Mia Yoshi used some kind of blood stain cloth and rubbed it against the seal. So he's the one who sealed the door. If I can get some of his blood, I should be able to escape from the manor. I'll wait until he's not looking when I strike and have some of his blood. Yeah, all right. Yeah, that makes sense. That totally that tracks. Yes, and we will continue talking about Ghostbusters on the next part. Yeah! It's kind of sick. We got him waiting for something. So thanks again for joining us. See us to, uh, see us in the next part. <laughs> Say goodbye, Spoot. Goodbye, Spoot. Finally, someone understands. <laughs> <laughs>